hey loves and welcome back to my channel and if you are new here welcome 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 my name is kayla and i am so happy to have you here so i decided so in today's video we're gonna be talking about i'm gonna say my current faves now that could all change now of course a lot of these i mean really to be honest with you these i don't think would change i feel like if i was um Still on a desert island and I can only bring like six body washes with me <laughs> these are what I would bring so we're gonna talk about these six body washes where's my other one? Oh, it's in the shower I gotta go get it but <laughs> I'm like looking I'm like one two three four five that's the one I use okay so yeah I have six body washes that I'm gonna talk about today these are like literally my faves and I love body wash you know I, I collect you know we hygiene junkies over here you know we have to try all different products and stuff like that but right now if i was on a deserted island i could only bring six body washes these are the ones that i'm gonna bring and we're gonna talk about these today so um give me one second let me go get this other body wash and then we can talk about it and if you guys are not already don't forget to hit that subscribe button below join the family we're almost at 200 subscribers and i'm so excited y'all thank y'all so much you guys are so bomb like you guys just don't realize how much of my day you make like i just love y'all so much you guys leave me such sweet comments like i love it make sure you leave me a comment to this video like this video all that good stuff but anyway let's get into the video and let's see what we got here now this is y'all know this is new i'm new to this one because i told y'all before like i've been passing this baby up for a while but now that i have her I don't know how I can live without her. So she's definitely coming with me on this deserted island. Hands down. Like, that's just, I can't live without her. So first one we have is this Method Body. And this one is the Coconut Rice Milk and Shea Butter. Okay, this baby right here. <sighs> she just is everything to me. She's everything. Like, I feel like I slept on her for so long, and I'm just so sorry. I'm sorry that I slept on her for so long. But, baby, let me tell y'all this. She smells so delicious. She lathers so nicely. And, I don't know. And, I, and it's a lot of these products. I really like products that have shea in it. So, yeah, there'll be a lot of that. But, anyway. It just smells so, so good. She's like a light and like, I don't know. She's just like, so it just reminds me of like soft cashmere. Um, like I have this body, um, this, um, my favorite wax melt from Walmart is called Cozy Cashmere, I believe. Um, and it reminds me of that. And it just smells so good. She's, she lathers so nicely. I'm not gonna lie. Like she just lathers beautifully. And I really love their packaging. Like, this is just... I love simplistic packaging. Like, to me, this is just amazing. But, yeah, she is everything. She makes my body feel moisturized. She smells. Like, this is... I love to wear this. I love to use her daytime, nighttime. It doesn't matter. Like, she's she's bomb. Like, she's, she's good for all year round for me. Like, I think she's great. So... Again, I slept on her for a long time, and now she's my baby. Again, these are in no particular order, but she's bae. Like, I can't live without her. She's definitely coming with me at all times. Like, no question. Okay, so another one that I love a lot is by OGX, and it's the Coconut Coffee Scrub Body Wash. This one has, like, the little beads in it, so it's like a gentle exfoliating. And, um surprisingly it, I mean it doesn't smell like coffee to me like I don't get coffee like I get a lot of like vanilla and coconut and just amazing goodness now I, I mainly like to use her in um the morning time but I use her at night too like I just she's amazing she has such a, an, an intoxicating smell if you're not like a coffee lover or anything like that definitely don't think that this is going to give you coffee vibes because it doesn't at all whatsoever like this doesn't smell like coffee at all i just get lots of vanilla and coconut 
and all that. But um, she is amazing. Okay. Um, I do want to try the the pink one. It's like, ro I think it's rose water and sea salt. I have not tried that one. But I'm obsessed with this one. So I figure maybe if I try that one, I might be obsessed with it. But right now, this baby right here, Deserted Island, you're definitely going because you're everything. Um, she left... She definitely leaves your skin feeling soft with these little um, gentle exfoliants that are in here. But yeah, I just like love this. Like she's amazing. Like I, I don't know. I just, I don't know anybody that doesn't love her to be honest with you. So if you have yet to try her, definitely try her. Like cause she's, and I don't know why I'm calling her her, but that's what she is. Try her because she's great. <laughs> But yeah, and um, she lathers beautifully. She has um, a very intoxicating scent. It's a very um, lingering scent for sure. Like it will le literally have your shower just smelling just divine, literally. So she's really bomb. Yeah, like I don't, I don't really, ha I don't have anything bad to say about her. Like she lathers great. She smells great. I like my whole bathroom just to smell like goodness. And that's exactly what she does. So she's definitely a, a definitely a, a go-to of mine for sure. One I feel like that is perfect for like we're getting into fall. So I mean I feel like she is literally perfect for this time. Um, so I picked this Caress Shea Butter and Brown Sugar. This is literally perfect for fall. Like, yeah, she's amazing. She smells delicious. I feel like she is, uh, she's she's definitely a go-to like all year round, but for especially for this type of season, she's everything. Um, this one also has like those little gentle like micro beads, like a gentle exfoliating um, wash. And she d she's definitely doesn't smell as strong as like the coconut coffee, but this baby she lingers too. She lingers too. She lathers nicely. And I don't ever have like all these, all of these body washes never make my skin feel dry. These are all like very moisturizing to me. Um, and I think just because of the, like the, sh like I said, like the shea butter, like I really have a thing with, for body washes with shea butter in them. So they, yeah, she does that. And it's just like, she just reminds me of like, I don't know like the baked goods it's the brown sugar I think it's just like just you want to smell like a snack <laughs> like literally if you want to smell like a snack she's gonna help you smell like a snack and she um lingers on the body very well at least on my body very well um I know everybody's chemistry is different and how scents kind of linger on your body but she definitely lingers on my body really well um and I love this like I don't know, she has like this like satiny kind of sheeny vibe, which I really love about her. Like she's just she's just beautiful. Like I love her. Amazingly. She's just she's everything. But yeah. She smells great. Again, perfect for fall. And she lathers great. Your skin is not drying. Like I love her. And I've loved Caress for a long time. I feel like Caress is probably one of my first body washes that like I like as a teenager when you really start getting into like stuff that you like I feel like Caress was like one of my go-to's so Caress has never failed to me um like ever and they're not super super expensive like some other body washes um but I love them all again but this right here desert um desert island yeah, you're going for sure. I couldn't choose between these two, so I picked both of these because, well, number one, I love all things Dove. I love all Dove products. Like, I haven't had a bad experience with any of their body washes. I feel like anybody in the hygiene community, I haven't heard anybody say anything bad about Dove. Like, I don't know anybody who doesn't love who doesn't love Dove. Um, but these are definitely just like my go-tos. Now, a lot of people talk about like the original Dove wash. Now, of course, that's that body wash is amazing, but these two are like beta me. And this one is the uh, glowing mango butter and almond butter. And this is the purifying detox with green clay. Now these two, I love them both. 
Um, this one mainly um, because, number one, I like mango scents. Like, I love the smell of mango. Something about it is just so amazing to me. And it just smells so delicious. Uh, it's like so tropical. Like, I just can't get enough. It's so tropical. It's just... Again, lingers on the skin. Has your shower smelling amazing. So, I love this. And, um, all these Dove body washes are always, like, like, they lather really great. Like, they lather amazingly. Now, I will say, I feel like this little baby right here, this Purify and Detox with Green Clay, for some reason... I love this lather. Out of all the Dove body washes that I've tried, something about this one, the way this one lathers, is like, I don't know how you describe it. Like, it's like elite to me. Like, it's so creamy. And maybe it has to do with the, the green clay in it, but it is so creamy and it is just amazing. It's just so super creamy. Now, it is, it says it's a detox. So I don't necessarily use this one every day. Um, again, all of these body washes are moisturizing, but I don't know if I was to use this every day, if it would end up drying out my skin because it would be, because it says it's a detox. And obviously it's, you know, trying to like detox your skin and renew it and all that good stuff. Um, but I do, I do use this like more than once a week and I love her. She's great mom.com for sure um but yeah this one doesn't really have like a uh like a special scent to it so if you like all of these i'm talking about how great they smell if you're like sensitive to smells this is definitely a good one to try of course the original body um the original dove is definitely good to try um as well for stuff like that but um this one doesn't have like like a fragrancy type scent. This one just kind of reminds me of like a spa. Like clean, refreshing. That's the kind of scent it gives me. So I do love this just for that. But of course, as far as like, I want to smell like tropical and beautiful and this, I would go for the mango one. But yeah, these two, I like I couldn't choose between the two. So they both had to come with me on this desert island because... I love them. I love them equally. I just can't. I can't. I can't not live without them. So, and then lastly, this baby right here. Um, this is the Olay Moisture Ribbons Plus Shea and Notes of Manuka Honey. I love Olay, especially this the uh, Moisture Ribbons um, body washes. Like these are just. Like, I feel like Olay is great, but these ones, like. I don't know like they did something different I feel like with these like these are just so silky on your skin like it's just these are very 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 rich in moisture like I don't even like if I feel like my skin needs like a little bit more TLC with the moisture this is probably one of the first ones that I go to just because it's so it's so moisturizing like it's just I don't know what it is. It's like, it's so rich, which I really love. And again, it has the Shea Notes. So, you know, I'm, I'm loving the Shea Notes. And this one smells. Ah, so good, y'all. Let me take a sip of this. My husband bought me Starbucks this morning. Oh, what is this? This is a pumpkin frap. I didn't even know that. I thought it was different taste than what he normally would get me. But that's good into pumpkin stuff like that and very much so but the pumpkin uh the pumpkin wraps at starbucks are amazing and um i'm a sweet potato pie kind of girl so that's my go-to that's what my family does um we don't really do pumpkin stuff but that pumpkin is great and um i have like a an old friend of mine she used to make pumpkin rolls all the time and they're just like um, tastes delicious. Um, I don't know. I had a bad 
experience with pumpkin pie one time and just didn't do it for me but anyway back to the body wash <laughs> but this one just smells like so sweet and i don't know this is kind of gives me a little bit of like perfumey vibes like i feel like this one definitely sits on the skin for a long time this will definitely have the aroma just lingering throughout your shower for sure even when you're done with it like it just sits on the skin so well it's just so sweet like i could literally sit here and just smell this bottle all day but yeah so i really love the olay like again super moisturizing the lather is great i don't have anything bad to say about that but yeah this one right here is just intoxicating to me like i just i love i love her she is bomb she will be with me at all times i can't get enough of her i used her last night i used her the night before <laughs> so right now she's been my go-to um for body wash at the moment but um it's usually these are the ones like i gravitate towards and sometimes sometimes just being like a, a body wash collector or not a body wash collector like a hygiene collector i have to make myself dry <laughs> like oh don't forget about this one that you have oh yeah yeah let me grab it um, because those are the ones I'm like, okay, let me, you know, use, I, I have to, I'll go, I'll buy those and then run out because I use those. And I'm like, the other ones are like, wait, what about me? Like, did you <laughs> forget about me? Oh yeah. Okay. But yeah, so those are just like, and don't get me wrong. I love all my body washes. They're all great. Like I don't have anything bad to say about them, but these are just like, my top tier body washes like those are always paid these are always gonna be the ones i go to those will be the ones that i would probably recommend the most out of everything so yeah that's just what it is um but what i want you guys to do i want you guys to comment down below and let me know if you are on a deserted island give me your we'll say your we'll say your top six your top six body washes that are must-haves that you have to bring with you that you cannot live without like, these are the ones that are going with you on this island. And you can't use nothing else. Tell me tell me what those are. And um, I'm excited to know what you guys, uh, what you guys pick. Because, yeah, those are just top tier to me. And I just love them so much. Side note, um, Pimpolina is, has disappeared. But she has left me a memory of her. So, um, <laughs> thankfully, it didn't take super long for her to, like, go away. But this memory is is here. I'm working on it. So, I have some stuff to kind of get that to go away. So, hopefully, sooner rather than later, the mark will disappear. But I'm glad she's gone. That way, she's not like, meh, meh. But it's easier to cover up, cover up just the mark as opposed to just her in general. Because she's, you know, raising all in your face. But this I can deal with this will go away eventually and I'm okay with that um and I'm just I'm prone to like scarring so it is what it is but yeah little successes and then we'll work on the rest um but yeah so um again thank you guys so much for watching do not forget to subscribe like comment on this video let me know what you guys like let me know if there's any videos that you guys like want me to to do because you guys are the ones who watch my content. So if there's something like specific that you're wanting to watch, let me know. Like, so I can try to shoot that for you guys for sure. And again, we're almost at 200 subscribers. So thank you guys so much. You guys are just amazing. I love you all. Like, you guys are just so bomb. And you guys, again, always leave me the sweetest comments. I have to kind of get rid of some of the weird pervy ones but whatever that's neither neither here nor there so weird at random like why would you comment on somebody's video like a pervert but anyway but everybody else you guys are great <laughs> you guys are great i love you guys so much um you guys are just awesome and um i will say all the time do not forget to follow me on the gram i'll always have that here follow me on tiktok um we're at like 300 subscribers on there and I'm so appreciative like I just anybody who follows me like I just thank you guys you guys just seem to like 
I'm just so appreciative that you guys enjoy my content. So that makes me happy and I love making it for you guys. It's a little, sometimes it's a little difficult. Like I have to try to like navigate and try to figure out how to squeeze it. Like literally I got up this morning. I recorded this last night. I'm not gonna lie. And didn't like it. I didn't like the way it came out. So um, I got up this morning and literally went in there. Um, wash my face, brush my teeth, clean my lashes. I didn't even make up my bed yet, y'all. <laughs> like, my husband brought me my coffee this morning. So sweet of him. And I was like, let me re-record it. Because we're going to redo this and all that good stuff. So, but yeah, I love you guys. Thank you so much. And um, I cannot wait to catch you guys in the next video. Until next time, bye.